If you haven't been here before, my name is Amanda Jupiter Anderson. And today I was inspired by one of my mentors who was speaking about how to stop letting angry people bug you. So I wanted to share what I thought about that with you and a few things that I heard from my mentor. Did you know that every time you resist acting on your anger, you're actually rewiring your brain to be calmer and more loving? <laughs> this is what I've been working on for a while now. And today, I protect my energy. I protect it and it is amazing. I have restored my brain to be more loving and calmer and it took lots of practice. It took lots of practice. However, I never gave up. I'm proud of myself today, my friends. I'm proud of myself because it's been a long road and I'm sensitive. I'm an empath so I can feel everything, everyone's energy but I've learned how to protect my energy. And a lot of times I've, you know, stayed alone because of this. You know, I stopped trying so hard for people who just didn't care. You see, to never be bothered or angry by people, I want to remind you, like my mentor reminded me today, a lot of times, other people project how they feel onto you. Okay, like my mentor says, it's projections all the time, projections. And it's very easy to absorb other people's energies, even more so for those of us who are sensitive or empaths. To stop letting others put their angry energy onto you, start protecting your peace. Yes, projecting your peace by simply saying, hey, you know, you're not going to bring your problems to me because I'm not going to accept them. You don't have to accept that invitation, my friends. You can return it to sender. <laughs> Famous words of Ralph Smart. And when you do this, you're not only protecting your energy, but also your peace of mind and you're creating healthy boundaries for yourself. So, you know, instead of thinking about the person you know who's making you angry, use that time to start focusing on someone who's always been there for you, okay? Because they deserve your attention, not someone who just doesn't care. Listen, my friends, people project onto us and it's not personal. It's never, ever been personal, my friends, never. A lot of people have other issues, okay, that they are dealing with. And we can sometimes feel like, you know, we are the problem, but actually they are the problem. They are the problem because many times it's their own issues. And then, you know, we just happen to come along and they're having, you know, a bad day at work or something and then project that anger, that bad day onto us. So protect your energy, protect your peace and simply don't allow it. Remember, remember, avoiding certain people to protect your emotional health is not a weakness. It is not a weakness. It's actually called wisdom. A wise man once asked, what is anger? And he gave a beautiful answer. It's a punishment we give to ourselves for somebody else's mistake. <laughs> and I wanted to share with you what Charles F. Glassman said, okay? He made this thing called the elimination diet, okay? which which goes like this. Remove anger, regret, worry, resentment, guilt, and blame, and then watch your health and life improve. Woo! 
And it's so true, my friends, because when I removed anger, regret, worry, resentment, guilt, blame, I mean, my entire life has improved, you guys. My health has even improved. So sometimes you have to let go of the picture of what you thought life would be like and learn to find joy in the story that you're actually living. So I don't have time for anger today, my friends. I don't have time to focus on being angry. I don't have time for that anymore because today I have laser focus on the joy in the story that I'm actually living right now in my life. And it's truly amazing. It's truly amazing, you guys. When I let go of the picture of what I thought life would be like is when I found that joy in the story that I'm actually living right now. Find joy in the story that you're actually living. Learn to be grateful for every single thing that you have in your life. Every single small thing, no matter how big or how small, be grateful for every experience. Everything that you go through, be grateful for it and watch. Watch how wonderful your health and your life begin to change. It is so mind-blowing. So my friends, I hope you found value out of this video and that it can help you, you know, to take a different perspective about dealing with other people's projections and that it's not personal. Because when you realize it's not personal, it becomes easier to move on and move forward and then project your peace onto them. So have a beautiful, blessed and creative day. Keep breathing in all that sweet ass energy because it is literally everywhere. And I will speak with you guys again soon. Human resonance is off the chain, my friends. Woo! Do you guys feel this awesome, powerful energy, you guys? Today is the perfect day to go out into the sunlight, go out into nature, and breathe in all that sweet ass energy. If you don't know what the Schumann Resonance is, it is literally the heartbeat, the vibration of the planet.